like to call to order the City of Douglasville City Council regular meeting for tonight, which is January the 14th. We'll have our invocation by our assistant city manager, Ms. Chelsea Jackson, and after that, the Mayor Pro Tem, Richard Siegel, will lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand for the invocation. Good afternoon, Mayor and City Council. We could all bow our heads. Thank you, God, for this love that you have made. Um, I rejoice, and we will all be glad in it. I pray for the lovely citizens for the city of Douglasville, as well as our elected officials that are standing before us. I pray that they make sound decisions that will direct positive decisions upon the city of Douglasville. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Thank you so much, Mayor Pro Tem, for leading us in the pledge, and Ms. Jackson for the um, invocation. We'll do announcements and presentations. We don't have any, so we'll go over um, the protocol for the meeting, and then we'll go into get right into the agenda. I'd like to welcome you to the City of Douglasville's regular City Council meeting. Tonight, the Council will vote on items that were discussed at our legislative work session. Um, items will be voted on tonight have been discussed and unless there is new information that you need to present, you do not need to reintroduce the same material that uh, was presented last Thursday. If the business you're here for to discuss is not listed as an agenda item, there will be ample time to discuss your business under the agenda item comments from citizens and delegates. I would ask um, if you were, wanted to come forward and speak with us that you would keep your comments and presentations on a professional level dealing with the facts. We will not accept comments that are considered to be an attack on any individual or group of individuals. And we'll ask that you will not um, applaud or cheer or make noises from the audience or speak to anyone else while you're, you're talking. Um, if you have a cell phone or electronic device, please put it in silent mode at this time so it won't be disruptive during the meeting. If you do come forward um, to speak under comments for citizens and delegates, you have five minutes to speak to us. And um, under the planning and uh, zoning and, and those departments, there is an um, opportunity for citizens. We give the chair will open up the floor and give 30 minutes for and 30 minutes against. And each person there has five minutes as well. So we'll move on and get right into our meeting. So now we are on item five of the agenda. It's minutes for approval. Open the floor for minutes for the minutes of the legislative work session of December 13th, 2018, and regular meeting and executive session of December 17th, 2018. I'll make a motion or open the floor for a motion to approve. I'll make a motion to approve the minutes as presented. Thank you so much. It's been properly moved and second to approve the um, minutes as presented. Are there any um, co corrections, deletions, or anything that anyone sees that needs to be added to the minutes? Thank you, not seeing any, any improvements or any um, objection. All those in favor of approving the minutes, please say aye. 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 <clears throat> Opposed, nay. The ayes have it, the minutes are approved. Open the floor for a motion to approve the consent agenda. Make a motion to approve the consent agenda as presented. Thank you so much, Mr. Thank Mayor. You. Thank you, it's been properly moved and second to approve the consent agenda as presented. Is there any further discussion as it relates to the consent agenda from council members? Not seeing any, all those in favor of approving the consent agenda, please say aye. 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 Opposed, nay. The ayes have it. The consent agenda is approved. We'll move on to item seven, which is public safety committee. That's chaired by Councilmember Samuel Davis. No items at this time, Madam Mayor. Thank you. Thank you so much, Councilman Davis. Community and Economic Development Committee. That's chaired by Mayor Pro Tem Richard Siegel. Thank you, Madam Mayor. No business tonight. Thank you, sir. Planning and Development Committee. That's chaired by Councilmember Mark Adams. Thank you, Madam Mayor. We have one item tonight uh, to vote upon. That's item 22-19-01. Consider a request for a revised plat approval at 8570 Hospital Drive for the purpose of adding parcel number 0050150040 of 2736 square feet for a total of 0.0663 acres at 8570 Hospital Drive in Landlot 50, District 1, Section 5, Parcel 58, application by Jack Chin. 
Is Mr. Chen in the audience? If so, sir, would you please come forward? Come forward to the podium, please, and state your name and address for the record. While Mr. Chen's coming down, I know that he was not here on Thursday night, so um, we'll give him the opportunity to make any comment that he would like. Go ahead, Mr. Chen. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. Yes. Name and address for the record, uh, please. Yeah, I'm Jia Chen, and the name, uh, the address, 8570 Hospital Drive. Okay. We have heard from Mr. Schaefer on your behalf on Thursday night concerning this um, revised final plat. And, and we have assumed, we'd like to hear from you, but we've assumed that this is you, you're adding 2,736 square feet to your property from some other source. Can you tell us about that, please? Oh, yes. Uh, that piece literally, the, uh, we got that from Georgia Power. Okay. Um, we, we already have a, a, have a plan to, you, you know, last, uh, last time we have uh, two pieces of land together and we, we try to rebuild the, the building, but we, maybe we share a little bit of the, uh, the parking area. Mm -hmm. and, uh, uh, and then later on, we asked Georgia Power because they don't use the, we, uh, in fact, we, they leased that piece of land to us for a long, long time already. And then we, we asked them see if they can sell to us. And then uh, they did, they, uh, so we bought that piece of land and uh, tried to combine with the, uh, uh, our land together and may uh, use that per um, uh, that way we, we, we will have a little more of the parking area okay. so so that's the purpose is that you've added property to your plat and you want to combine it all oh uh, yeah one. combine them all together uh, right. okay. yes because we we already have uh, else, all the other we have the uh, the plan for the city to review, uh, to build the, the new session on the open lot. Yes, sir. Yeah, okay. and, but just need a little more space for the parking lot. Uh, if we don't have that one, we, we had to cut a little bit on our old lot uh, for the dumpster. So that piece is just right for us. I understand. Okay. And uh, uh, Georgia Power sold that one to us. Okay. okay. Are there any questions of counsel uh, to Mr. Chen concerning this? Any public comment? Okay. Seeing none, then uh, on item 2219-01, I make a motion to approve. Thank you. I have a motion. Is there a second? Thank you. Second. Thank you. It's been, hang on for a second, Mr. Chen. Hold on, Mr. Chen. We're not finished yet. One minute. It's been properly moved a second to approve item 22-19-01. Is there any further discussion from council members? Do we have any questions from Mr. Chen? Thank you, not seeing any further discussion. All those in favor of approving item 22-19-01, please say aye. Aye. Opposed, nay? The ayes have it. Thank you, Mr. Chen. Thank Appreciate you, you coming you. in. Thanks, sir. Madam Mayor, that's all that we have tonight under planning and development. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Chairman. We'll move on to item 10, Parks and Recreation Committee. That's chaired by council member Chris Watts. Thank you, Madam Mayor. We have no business tonight under Parks and Recreation. Thank you, sir. Finance Committee, Council Member uh, Chairman Mark Adams. Thank you, Madam Mayor. We have no business in finance tonight. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Information and Technology Committee, that's shared by Council Member Terry Miller. Thank you, Madam Mayor. We have no business at this time under Information and Technology. Thank you, sir. Maintenance and Sanitation Committee, that's shared by Council Member Chris Watts. Thank you, Madam Mayor. We have no business tonight under Maintenance and Sanitation. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. We'll move on to Transportation Committee. That's chaired by Councilmember Dr. LaShawn Burdanley. Thank you, Madam Mayor. No items tonight under Transportation. Thank you, ma'am. It's good to see you. You're welcome. Item 15, Personal and Organization Committee. That's chaired by Mayor Pro Tem Richard Siegel. Thank you, Madam Mayor. No business tonight. Thank you, sir. Ordinance and Intergovernmental Committee. That's chaired by Councilmember LaShawn Burdanley. No items tonight, Madam Mayor, under ordinances and intergovernmental. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Dr. Danley. We'll move on to education and training. That's chaired by Councilmember uh, Samuel Davis. No business tonight, Madam Mayor. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, communications Committee. That's chaired by Councilmember Terry Miller. 
We have no business tonight under the Communications Committee. Madam Mayor. Thank you so much, Councilman Miller T. Is there any other business to come before council tonight from council members from the elected body? Thank you, not seeing any. Then we'll move on to item 20. We have any reports from our city attorney, Mr. Joel Dotson? No business, Madam Mayor. Thank you, sir. Chief Assistant City Attorney, Ms. Susan Littlefield? No business, Madam Mayor. Thank you, ma'am. Chief of Police, that isn't a chief. That's Mr. JR. <laughs> no business, Madam Mayor. Thank you so much. We'll move on to our city manager, Ms. Marsha Hampton. Um, just to remind you all, you do have a legislative work session on this coming Thursday. Um, so we're back on our regular schedule with the exception of the holiday on Monday. Okay, city manager, do we have um, committees as well Thursday? Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right, thank you so much, city manager. Comments from citizens and delegates. Now is an opportunity for um, citizens in the audience that may want to approach. If you would like to speak with us and have anything to say, you're welcome to come to the podium. And if you come forward, give your name and address for the record, and then you can you have five minutes to address the council. You know, just observing. Okay. We'll move on to staff reports. Do we have any staff reports? Okay, well, if not, then executive session. Um, we have opened the floor for a motion to adjourn into executive session to discuss a property disposition. Madam Mayor, I make a motion to adjourn into executive session to discuss property disposition. Thank you. Thank, thank you so much. It's been properly moved and second to adjourn into executive session. All those in favor of adjourning, to ex and ex adjourning into executive session, please say aye. 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 Opposed, nay. The ayes have it. We are adjourned to executive session to discuss a property disposition.